Today, we are going to look at the brand new Office 2021 and all of the new features. This is the latest one-time purchase option for desktop apps like Word, Excel, and PowerPoint since Office 2019. If you wanna know what are all the different plans and how does this compare to Microsoft 365, check out the video right up above. In this video, we're purely looking at what's new in Office 2021. Before we get started, to watch more videos like this one, please consider subscribing. All right, let's check this out. You now have something called real-time co-authoring and that's available in Word, Excel, and PowerPoint. This allows you to work with others on the same document. The one caveat is your document has to be stored in OneDrive, but you can access at least five gigabytes for free. You also get access to modern comments. You can see who's in your document at the same time. There's also been a visual refresh and it matches the look of Windows 11. You'll see rounded windows, a more neutral color palette, and just overall a softer look. You also get access to stock images and icons. You can use Microsoft Search in the apps to look for functionality or help. Your documents will now auto save. This way you don't have to worry about constantly pressing Control S. You can now save documents in the open document format or ODF. There is an updated draw tab. You could use a sketched style outline. You could enter hex colors in the color picker. There have also been performance updates across the board. In Excel, there are now many new functions. There's a new one called XLOOKUP, which is quite a bit better than VLOOKUP. It allows you to look things up in your spreadsheet. If you wanna learn more about XLOOKUP, check out the video right up above. You can now also use dynamic arrays, like filter, sort, sort by, and there are many others. You can use the let function, and with the let function, you can assign names to calculation results. You can also use xmatch, and with this function, you can search for a specified item in an array, and you can get the relative position back. You can also set up various sheet views to help you get back to the view that you care about. In PowerPoint, you can now record your presentation using video and audio. You can also record your inking on a slide. In Outlook, you can now instantly search for messages. And lastly, you can also ink to annotate your message in Outlook. In Word, there's something new called Line Focus, which helps you read a document by just focusing on one line at a time. Lastly, Microsoft Teams now comes bundled together with Office. Previously, you could download Microsoft Teams, but now it just comes with Office, so you no longer have to go out to get it. All right, that wraps up what's new in Office 2021 compared to Office 2019. If you wanna see a list of everything that's new, I've included a link in the description down below. To watch more videos like this one, please consider subscribing. I'll see you next time. Thank you.